Would you guys just look at the natural lighting happening right now? It is middle of the day and there is not a single light on in the house. Because everywhere I look is loaded full of windows. This is Puplum's space that I showed you guys last night. This is the downstairs living room that is going to end up being Ryan's study area, but for now has our living room furniture in it. And this is the upstairs living room that will end up being like the main family hangout area. We'll get the furniture moved up here and everything else. And middle little right here is loving the fact that she now lives in the same time zone as her bestie. I'm pretty sure they've been on FaceTime since she woke up today. All of the natural lighting and windows in the house is like my absolute favorite thing about this new house. Cause you know, I lived in a wooden cave in Alaska with very little windows and natural lighting. This really does feel like a breath of fresh air, but you guys have been asking for a kitchen reveal, so let's go check it out. Okay, you guys ready to see where all the cooking and mapling is going to be happening very soon? Now mind you, we're still moving in. I still have things to put up and figure out where things go, but we have a little breakfast nook right here. That is Puplum's over in there, and so that's going to remain strictly Puplum's. This will be where our dining room table goes. I love the countertop and cabinet right here. It's so cute. And this is the kitchen. We do have a dishwasher, a double oven, and then a separate stovetop right there. And then the refrigerator is in like this separate little utility hallway here right next to the kitchen. With a very sweet little pass through into Puppalums. This house turned out to be the perfect blend for our family. Not only is it five bedrooms, so there's room for everybody because Ryan's dad is living with us, but also there is a perfect mix of like modern farmhouse styling and rustic farmhouse living. And everyone keeps asking about, was there anything that was unexpected or anything we were disappointed in or anything like that? Because we didn't see this house in person until we landed here yesterday. And I'm gonna be very honest with you and say that it has been everything and more than what we were expecting and hoping for whenever we first started looking at it. And you certainly can't beat big, huge front porch views. I'm totally in love out here. So I guess that's about as close as we're gonna get to an actual house tour because I'm not gonna do a walkthrough layout and I'm not gonna show the private areas like the bedrooms and things like that. But don't worry, there is a big house full of needs for furniture and organizing and decorating and I'm gonna bring you guys along for every bit of the journey. But for now, Ryan and I are off to the post office to pick up all the stuff we mailed to ourselves because they showed up today and said, hey, we're running out of space, will you come get your stuff? And I have a mountain of UPS deliveries that I need to see about bringing inside and opening up as well. Don't worry, you guys know there's going to be unboxing videos for you, so I'll share in the next couple videos.